Now think about my childhood because we're still teaching things to children that somebody taught us some, some, bad, some bad things, like nursery rhymes. Why are we still teaching children nursery rhymes? Have y'all read these things? <laughs> there was an old lady that lived in a shoe. She had so many children. She didn't know what to do. So she fed them broth without any bread and whipped them all soundly and put them to bed. <laughs> yeah, that lady going to jail. You can't, um, you can't do that in 2019. Not... Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater, had a wife. He couldn't keep her. He put in a pumpkin shell. And there he kept her very well. <laughs> yeah, Peter has a Netflix documentary coming out next year. Called, uh, the making of a murder of pumpkin pie style, that's all. Uh... We were teaching them dumb songs. My son starts singing this dumb song, 10 Little Monkeys, jumping on the bed. One fell off, bumped his head. Mama called a doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. Then it was nine little monkeys. <laughs> then eight little monkeys. Then seven little monkeys. I'm like, this doctor not gonna call child protective services on this woman, this woman. This woman clearly overwhelmed with these children. She need to call the old lady in the shoe. That's what she need to call. I bet you they won't jump on that bed no more. Every time it would rain, I sang this dumb little song to my son and somebody sung to me. It's raining, it's pouring. The old man is snoring. He went to bed and bumped his head and couldn't get up in the morning. I'm like, why am I singing homicide hymns to my son before he go to sleep? The boy gonna have nightmares. It's incredible, man. And so much has changed for my children. They can Google anything. Information is at their fingertips. When I was a kid, you couldn't Google information. If you wanted information, you had to go to the encyclopedia. And I was a weak little kid, so I couldn't pick up the encyclopedia. So I had no information. I remember when I didn't know how to spell a word, I would ask my mother how to spell a word. You know what my mother would tell me? Look it up in the dictionary. I was like, mama, I don't know how to spell the word. <laughs> Y'all, I spent four weeks in the L's looking for elephant. I was like, mama, I don't. <laughs> mama, I don't see that word. I see leprosy. I don't see anything about an elephant. <laughs> Almost blacked out looking for pneumonia. I was like, I don't know. What's going on in here? <laughs>